Welcome back to Big Her the Nerd and today's very special episode as we are in the Carabao Cup final. The only bit of silverware we may get this season. Three seasons in our first final against Arsenal. It is the first time in the club's 126 year history uh, that we could be winning the Carabao Cup apparently. So uh, a very historic day. As you can see I've got the claret suit on ready to rock and roll so let's have a look at where we have been before we get into this episode and i will ask if you are enjoying the series so far to smash that like button and hit subscribe if you are new if you are new welcome to the channel welcome to the first final now let's have a look so we left you last after the tottenham and the villa game and that was after we beat liverpool uh, we then went on <laughs> to beat newcastle one nil we got a cheeky little one goal Trin uh, trincal getting in Got us the victory there. We didn't beat Wolves 3-1. Uh, Fernandes getting two goals. Pellegrini getting a goal. Uh, and a consolation for them. We then smashed Palace 4-1. Fiat Arp getting three goals. A hat-trick for Arp. Um, and then just drew 0-0 against Stoke. A game we should have won. But because it was played on the Wednesday and this game was on the Sunday, we played almost a completely rotated team. They played really well. Just couldn't get goals. Which is not good for us. We also have had some issues with injuries if we have a look Pellegrini has been knocked out for it was four weeks at the time it's now two weeks Santelles is out again for three weeks Costina is out for two weeks Diop's still not back and Arp just got knocked out in the last game for two weeks which means we only have Moise Keane as our striker literally our only striker it's terrible we didn't bring anyone in as a striker in the transfer window so that didn't go very well in today's episode we will bring you just the final will play on slightly extended highlights to give us the best chance of winning. And we will also go through the transfer activity. As you notice, our 90 million is now a mere 29 million. Although we've got a shite ton in the wage budget, so we can put some more in. So we did bring in some players. So we have brought in Gavin Bazuna. We did it. We went and bought the goalie. We paid a shit ton. I paid 89 million for him. Rising to 106. It was like split over years and with multiple bloody fees. But yeah, he's now worth 56 million. We we paid a lot. He's two star current ability, four star potential. I mean, he looks very, very good. I mean, even his mentals are quite good for someone who's only 19 years old. Uh, and we'll have to start playing him, I think, from next season. Uh, his history is mental. He bought was bought for 425,000 uh, by Man City in 2019 from Shamrock Rovers. And then, uh, yeah, just two seasons later, we paid 89 million for him. And I know you're going to say I overpaid. I did overpay. But he's six foot three goalie. He's bloody strong. He's got good jumping reach. He's going to be beastly. He will just be our goalie. We need to spend big on one goalie. This is the one. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. That sees us all the way through now. He is. Gavin Bazuna, the Irish goalie, is going to see us through the rest of this save now. So we spent big. Uh, we also spent 25 million on Rafa Pereira, a central midfielder. He's two and a half star current. Could go up to four. Looks okay. Another Portuguese player. A lot of very, very good Portuguese players in here. Good work rate, uh, good determination, good uh, natural fitness. So quite good on the physicals and mentals uh, and not bad on the technicals either. We'll play in uh, as, what do we have? We have Metzalas and DLPs. You can play both of those roles fairly well. So a very good backup we've got in there. We did not get anyone else. Um, we did sell Tony Martinez. We let a lot of guys go out on loan. Um, but yeah, we didn't get who we wanted. I tried to get Goebbels. That didn't work. I tried to get a load of wingers. They all were really expensive, especially those that are already at uh, the top Prem clubs. So we're screwed. We have been out scouting. We are scouting thoroughly now. We are scouting 15-year-olds th thoroughly. When March comes around and the Youth Intech Day happens, we will be scouting all of the top clubs with the top youth uh, divisions to try and find some players. So get your suggestions in the comments down below of cut of um, clubs you know that have very good youth academies and you've seen some very good wonder kids come through. Because we're pretty much out of the realms of you guys suggesting players anymore. But you can suggest clubs with good youth academies that we can raid. So do that. Looking at the team, we've been playing very well. We're finally getting some green lines in here. Riccardi's been playing very well alongside Gravenberch. Rice, solid as ever. Yama is back. 
Trincao going back out on the left. Yama's first game back, really. So hoping he comes back with a bang because we've got Moise Keen up front um, after Pellegrini got injured, who is really our top goal scorer. Tonali is also back. Um, first game back again, but we're not going to play him. We're going to rest him. There's no point throwing him in straight away. And it all go in tits up. We've got Jalo and Reese Oxford at the back. Them two very, very strong. Building a better relationship. Um, but we are really looking forward to Diop coming back. Uh, <clears throat> we've Costina out as well. We've got Quero in. He's been playing pretty well. Average rating is 7, you can see. Actually, a lot of our players have been playing pretty well, actually. So, I'm, I'm positive. We've beaten Arsenal before. Well, we beat him 4-1 somewhere. Where did we beat him? Yeah, we beat him 4-1 away. That was a pretty good result for us, have to say. Uh, and then we've got them coming up, yeah, in a few games' time. So, I mean, we don't know how this is going to go, do we? It's going to go one of two ways. We're either going to get goals or we're going to struggle to score and they're going to steal it from us. I'm hoping Yama comes in, Trinkau come in and Gravin Birch all to add goals. Uh, almost keen just the science he's going to be a striker and start banging them in. But it's our first final. It's, it's, it's exciting. To, to have the potential of getting some silverware three seasons in with a team that's starting to now gel and connect. I'm getting very excited. So let's get in to the Carabao Cup final. So here we are lining up with Fabs in goal. Sessegnon, Oxford, Jallo and Cuero as the back four. Rice, Gravenberch and Riccardi in the middle with Trincao on the left. Yama on the right and Moise Keane up top going against very strong Arsenal team. Shea's up. We know we've got to watch out for. He's very, very good. Uh, Ertzel, he's getting old now. Uh, Inaki Williamson score. Uh, Bellerin, I'm not sure how good he is, actually. It's not, I mean, I'm, I'm not too worried. They're going to play attacking, which kind of plays into our hands. We're going to do some marking up of Chaser because uh, he is a problem. He does score. He does get himself in a lot of situations. So we're going to go with that. Uh, but I'm I'm still I'm mildly confident. Mildly confident. My only worry is goal scoring. If we had pedigree, I'd be much happier. So let's go on a passionate. Get out there and prove to everyone you're winners. Oh, it worked on a few of them. I will take a few of them. Uh, Shaza, we are going to close down and tackle hard just to try and throw him off his game. But that's it. Everyone else can stay the same. And in we go. We've also made some changes to the scouting team uh, in the background. We're going to go for comprehensive highlights here. Uh, so Julian Dix is back in the club. We've, we've let Joe Cole go. Uh, he wasn't good enough. Uh, I just wanted to sign him because I love Joe Cole. And we've also changed our assistant manager. So now Hayden Mullins is our assistant manager as Everton comes forward here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Chase up good. Yama's on the ball. Nice. This is the opening highlight. Can we calm down, guys? So yes, Hayden Mullins is our new assistant manager. We got rid of the, the original guy that was in there who was Pellegrini's right-hand man to bring in the old West Ham player, Hayden Mullins. Pretty good assistant manager, actually. As Shazer comes forward, Quero does well there. So we're starting to build our staff up now. Um, we'll go back to the board and ask for a few more youth things after this season. But let's see what we can get here as Gravenberch plays a lovely ball forward. Riccardi now out to Quero on a rainy day here at Wembley. Jallo now, Gravenberch. Going to go outside. He does. Sesson Young's in. He's got a lot of men in the box. He's got it in the box. Yama's there. Easy header for Leno to pick up. Come on, Yama. Bounce back with a goal. That's what I want to see. Cuero now. We've got him on a counter here. Yama. He's found Trincao. Oh, what a strike. Oh, wish he'd got that down. Come on. One of you wingers has got to help me out. Or Keen. Moist Keen. You can just you can do it if you want. We've got a lot of goals in this team. We're starting to learn how to score. Just someone's got to take that initiative. His chasers in behind Naki Williams. Fabianski. Fumbles it wide. Come on, win me a trophy, boys. Win me a trophy. Good header. Can we chase it out? Go on. Don't slide in. Now slide in. Oh. Emerson. Out to Melikovic. Bellerin. Everton. <clears throat> Arsenal are, are dominating here, but we're closing them down. We're not letting them get too much. They are closing down quite a lot, which is good for us if we can start playing quicker, sort of more direct balls. So we may use that for the second half. If they do push forward, we can get behind. Nicely done by Cuero there. That's the ball. Oh, Trinkau. Read it. Remember, Yama's back. He's your boy. Inaki Williams, Oxford straight in. But shazer has got it again. Cuero, it's all you. Yes, with the slide. He seems like he's up to the chance, uh, the, the job today. Can we clear another corner? No. Oh, my God. That bounce down. Into the middle of the box. Bellerin. Out to Urza. We are getting dominated here. Naki Williams is in again. Fabianski with the save. Right. 
We've let they're let, we're letting it too much now. Go for standard passing. We're on. Do we need to go for that? We're on much higher line. I like it. We've got to get stuck in on. Um, I don't want to use tight marking, but you know what? Let's distribute to the flanks as well. Let's get it further out. Right here we go. We've made the changes. Let's see if that makes any difference now. Big ball forward. Riccardi to Keane. Can he get the ball inside? There's three defenders pulled out of play. Keane, come on. Three defenders pulled out of play. One ball in and we would have had that then. Yama now. Corner in. Out swinger. No one's gone for it. Graven Birch gives Yama another go. Inside to Riccardi. Yama again. Someone just... You're not quite on the pace, guys. Not quite on the pace. Jallo now. 20 minutes in. Graven Birch. Go on, out it goes. Oh, you passed it straight to them, you bellend. What are you doing? No, and Aki Williams is behind again. Oh, he's fired it over. I'm willing to let him keep having that because his shooting isn't great, is old Williams. Um, and our defense are quick. They do get back. Keen now. Come on. Do the job. Graven Birch. Yes! Ryan Graven Birch. What a strike. Moist Keen with a lovely layoff, which hopefully gives him a bit more of a boost. And 20 minutes in, we go 1 0 up. Big kick forward. Who is this? Yama wins the header. Yama wins the header. Moise Keane looks up and Graven Birch busts a nut to get in the box. First time. What a bullet of a strike. What a leader. That man has just had a new contract. He's gone up to a key player. I need to get better at this contract management as I'm going to get screwed over by these guys. Um, but definitely worth it. 18-year-old. He's going to stay in this team for a very long time. As Shazer is in behind two defenders there. No one puts a tackle in. Oxford clears. Long shot again. So far, so good. They're coming at us. Whoa, they're coming at us. Right, Shazer. Emerson. Oh, Nitschen. Good block. He's gone for it again. Fabianski with a save. Oof. They are going for it. Keen now. Can we catch him out? Graven Birch. Keen again in. No one's there, mate. Trinkau. Inside. Oh, Trinkau. So close. So close. Corner. Right, one of you is out swinging again. Someone go for it this time. Jallo. He's up. Riccardi. Oh, if that fell a little bit nicer. Yama now. Put a good ball in, mate. No, you've fannied around with it again, Yama. You let me down, mate. Fab's now. Big ball forward. 30 minutes in. Still the first half here. I forgot we up the uh, the highlights. As Williams is there. Chaser. Good block. Oh, the guys are motivated. I'm not going to give any more shouts now. It's not going so well, though. Everton is getting a lot of space. Can we get in? No, that's a good ball. Naki Williams. They are pushing us now. Trincao is not having a good game. Torreira. Oxford clears into the middle of the box for some stupid reason. Everton space blocked again. Corner again. How do we get ourselves out of this mess? They are literally hounding us. And we cannot seem to get the ball down to get it away. Emerson, look at this. Guys, 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 guys. Get... The ball back. Where are you? You're, you're second to everything. Everton. Back to Bellerin. Blocked. We're on positive. We're not on defense. We're just throwing everything we've got the ball. We can't seem to keep it. We don't seem to get highlights where we actually have the pissing thing. Yama now. Ah, oh, Yama. What a waste. Is the move to take Yama off. Fabs, what are you doing, mate? What are you doing? Fucking spooning it out for a corner. Throw in. That's what you should have gone for. Right, can we get in? Can we get into half time without going down now? Without letting a goal in, giving away this lead. Graven Birch is in. Keane's there. Trinkau's there. Oh, he was offside. I was hoping that was a foul. Corey, where we're going? We're attacking now. We've got the ball back. Yama, lay it off. Lay, lay it off. I'll put it in. Riccardi. Oh, he's got space. Graven Birch, ping it. Oh, Trinkau. Oh, guys, put the freaking ball in the box. Oh, half-time whistle's gone. That's seven shots, only two on target. Riccardi's not playing well. Right, let's go for assertive. Don't get complacent. You look stressed. You're playing shy. So the selected players are assertive, not happy. Send them back out, second half. Trinkau, you need to pick up your performance, mate. I know you want to go out on that right-hand side as an inside forward, but... You need to pay. You need to pay where the team needs you, mate. Keane's definitely fouled someone there. Leno now, big clearance. Right, win this header. 
Yes, Oxford wins. No one in the middle picks up, though. Everton. He's got a lot of space to run into. No. Oh, unlucky Williams. I mean, it's been coming, right? It's been coming all game. How has Everton got that much space, though? That's what I don't understand. Where's he come from to... We're defending wide. He's picking up on his halfway line. He's just bombing it down. I'm not watching that. I'm not watching it back. Uh, Everton can be closed down. Oh, crap. Now we're screwed because we've not had anything go our way for a long time and we've been holding on to that 1-0. They could easily go and get a few more goals now. Yama back to Curero. Riccardi. Does it build the play up? Ravenbirch. Play our style. Yama wins the header. Doesn't go through though. No, I'm going to take, take passing space off. Let's play. Let's play our way. Torriera now in. Back post. Cleared. Nicely done. Go and get it. Trinko, get it. You've been shy all game. There we go. You have been really shy all game. I'm going to have to bring you off. Which is I'm really annoying because, I mean, we've struggled. And to have our best players. He's down at 6.2. <sighs> Fernandez, Correa. Or Mahasini. Mahasini hasn't played great. And Matt, we're going to have to play him in though. Because he's a winger. Mahasini, you have got a chance to come in and be an absolute hero. Rice is knackered. So Tonali could come in. Tonali has a better, not a better tackle, but does have a better ball on him. So let's try that. Rice out, Tonali in. Maybe we've got a bit more of a playmaker there who can ping a long ball. Trink out off because he's just playing dog turd. Mahasini, chance to be a hero. Throw Emerson now. Ricardi clears. Nitchum. Torreira. Bellerin's overlapped again. He's cut it back. Great ball. Jalo clears into the box like a bell end. Come on, get the possession. That's good. We forced them back and we forced a mistake. Oh no, we haven't. Bellerin's got it. He's got it in as well. <sighs> boys, boys, boys. Demand more. I need more. Big kick to no one. Yama's there. Good. Where are you going with it, mate? Right, hang on. We will take that off as well in transition. Oh, he's back to fullbacks. He's not distributing it properly, is he? Jalo now. Plays a lovely ball. No one's reading it, though. Even though we're squished on space, no one's reading anything. Williams is now in. Oh, Fabianski. That was a dodgy, dodgy, bloody save. Oh, how much I wish we had Pellegrini, man. Or oh, Arp. Arp did well. And then got freaking injured. Gravenberch. Oh, I thought he was going to ping a long one. Yama. Oxford, that's not who want. Riccardi, you can do it as well. Oh, why are you passing it back and do it? You're killing me. You're killing me. A corner now. Yama again. Oxford, it's all yours, mate. There we go. Back post. Didn't even go for it. Against Bellerin. Gets a freaking midget of a right back. You as a powering centre back. And you let him have it. Not good enough, man. Not good enough at all. Tonali now. He's in. Tonali. Lay it off. Cuero. All in. Ah. Right, who else is playing crap? I saw 6.4. Cuero. I haven't got Greenidge. There's no point putting him on. Got some. Ah, oh, we've got some good playmakers, man. What are they doing? Jalo. There we go. Gravenberch. Some space. Good ball. Cuero wins the header. Yama. Yamalenko. One on one. On the volley. Manages to hit the fucking goalie. How is that even possible? They've brought on Mustafi. Come on. Cessna on Gravenberch. This has got to be. Now's our chance. Riccardi. Sessignon. The ball. We just need one good ball. Gravenberch is there again. He's offside. Of course. Why not? Clearance. Jalo clears. Pfft. I mean, if Keane ever went for a freaking header, it'd be a miracle. Bellerin. Blocked. They're going to challenge now. They're going to push late. Don't let them push late. Don't let them push late. Mustafi clears. Right, I'm going to give him a push forward. Come on. We've got to sneak this late. We're on attacking. We've got to do it. Nitchum, Ertzil, no. Yes, Yama's there. Yama Lenko, you are a piece of shit. I can't wait for you to leave. Honestly, if I played Trinkau where he wanted to play, I wonder if this had been a different game. Sessignon, blocked. No, Nitchum. <laughs> Less than 10 minutes to go. I've pissed them off. El Noassi is not playing great. Right, we've got one sub. Sessignon. Masuaku, is that the move I should have done in the first place? Let's go, let's go for it. I mean, El Noassi is going to hate it, but Masuaku had a good last game. Sessignon is good at putting a corner in. A crossing even. Torriera now. Ertzil. Oh no, Grimaldo's in behind. They've got fresh legs on. They've got fresh legs on. 
five minutes to go. Don't let a corner in now. Do not. Out it goes. Out it goes. Out it goes. And again, follow up. Follow up. Follow up. Yes. Follow up. Yes, Quero. Keen. Fuck's sake, Keen. Oh, my God. Session Young now. Masuaku's inside. There we go. Oh, we still got it. We still got it. Give it back. Ball inside. Smash it in. Oh, you bend. Why did you stop? Cross now. Corner, sorry. Yama. Make up for you being rubbish. Oxford. <laughs> Please. Please. <laughs> Three minutes to go. How are we going to do this? Sessignon. No. Masuaku's there, though. Oh, Grimaldo read it. Good header, though. Keane's won a header, but he was offside again because he can't seem to stay onside. Oh, 88 minutes. This is the time. No, nope. Keane, lay it off. Lay it off. Oh, Yama's there. Lay it inside. You've got men in the box. Literally waiting for it. That's the one. Oh, you've laid it all the way back to Tonali. There was a man in the box. It was Graven Merch. He can rifle them, you bell. Masuaku now. Swing it in. Swing it now. I've got it on hit crosses early. Why don't you do what I say? A corner. This has got to be the moment. Yama. Fine Oxford. Oxford, please score. You Riccardi. Ah, oh, Leno. <sighs> Four minutes. There's a great throw there. Oh, and Naki Williams is on his own. How the hell did he end up on his own, guys? What are you doing? Jalo. Into Gravenberch. Nice pass. Riccardi. Keep it simple. Gravenberch again. Big ping. I like, ah, I like your style, but not quite the right ball. That's it. That's it. Build it. Ah, oh, it's ping. He's offside again. He's got to be offside. Ref, he's got to be offside. Ref, how is he not offside? Fucking hell, Naki Williams goes through right at the end. Minutes, minutes left. Two minutes left. Good head, Yama. Now, use your right back. That's it. You go inside. Yama's there. Lay it off. Don't shoot. Oh, you've shot. You, gr you greedy fuck. You shot and hit Moise Keane. And then he was offside again. Oh, my God. Yamalenko, you are definitely being fi uh, fired. You're definitely being sold. I would have sold you if you weren't injured, to be honest. Because I need you to step up here. And you've not done anything, have you? You've really just didn't done nothing. Ten seconds to go. <sighs> Is it going to go extra time? Oh, whoa, 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 Fabs, just go along with it, mate. There we go. Jesus Christ. Coming for a short ball with seconds left to go. So, this episode has got a little bit long, hasn't it? So I'm going to do a really horrible thing to you now and end it here. Part two will be out tomorrow at 5 p.m. Unless this video gets 50 likes. If you've managed to get to the end and you want to know what happens in the extra time, then smash that like button 50 likes and i will release the video this evening around 7 p.m ish and if not then it will be your video for tomorrow i know i'm being mean but this is fun for me it's like half one in the morning and i'm editing this video so i thought why not i'm up late let's have a little bit of fun so 50 likes and you get the video tonight if not you get the video tomorrow how do we finish this final so I will leave it there. I will see you next time. Have a great evening. Bye-bye.